Have you ever saved the JPEG and it ended up looking like this, where it looks normal up until you start to zoom in and you can see that there is a lot of large pixels and very noticeable areas that look very pixelated. This is something that happens when you compress a JPEG down or any image in general, you compress it down to lose a bit of quality, but you are then reducing the file size, making it more easier to load when you're going on a website. And just in general, it makes the file size smaller. Well, to fix this, all you have to do is go to filter right at the top and then go down to neural filters right here. Once you've loaded up, you then want to go down to the third filter, which is the JPEG artifacts removal. Now, if you've never used this before, you want to first of all, go ahead and click on the cloud icon to download this filter. And once you've got it downloaded, you then want to left click on here to enable it. Once you've got it enabled, you will have one specific option and that is the strength of it. And if you click in here, you can either set it to low, medium or high. I would honestly recommend to always set it to high just because it may take a little bit longer, but it will look a lot better. So as you can see from this image, this is the before and this is the after. There is a big difference, especially if you zoom in, you can see the before and the after. It just looks a lot better. So then once you're happy with your results, you can go to output and in here, set it to a new layer and go ahead and press OK. And there you go. So you have your new one that you've just created and your original underneath. And that is pretty much it. That's how you remove artifacts and pixelated areas from your JPEGs in Photoshop.